Sound 13, a spring man says he was cuffed and accused of threatening to kill his family and then himself. He says he was the victim of a swatting call that also duped deputies. ABC 13's Liliana Pearson is live outside the Constable Precinct 4's office who responded to the fake call. And Liliana, what have they been able to tell you about this case? I've been reaching out to the constables today uh, to learn more about this fake swatting call, but so far at this point, I haven't heard back from them yet. But what we do have is doorbell video of the moment law enforcement showed up at this homeowner's front door. They're dressed in tactical gear. They have firearms and they're demanding the door be opened. Late Tuesday night, Troy Taylor, his wife, son and mother slept in their beds when next day I know I heard like a banging at the door. When I get to the door, I see a bright, shiny light outside of my door, but I can't see anybody when I look through the blinds. What we can see on Taylor's doorbell video is law enforcement in tactical gear armed with weapons. Taylor says he opened the door, stepped out, and is cuffed by police as they start demanding answers. You know what we're here for. And, and so I was like, no, I, I don't. Taylor says after about an hour of sitting in a precinct for patrol car and his family being talked to, he's let go. He says constables tell him he's a victim of swatting, that somebody sent in a digital tip pretending to be Taylor, claiming he was about to kill his family and himself. If it's a prank, it's not a good prank because, you know, you're affecting people's lives. Taylor doesn't know why he would be a target of a call like this. I just really had a hard time sleeping. I'm still kind of shaky about it because, you know, what do they do next? Constable's office, open the door. And doesn't ever want it to happen to his family again. I hope it's a one and never. The FBI tells us people who make swatting calls are often serial offenders. They typically also go on to commit other digital crimes like identity theft. <laughs>